We woke up to not a sunny day, quite cloudy. Uh, so we phoned the Bombeiros to authorize us to do a K mother, which is a bonfire. And as we decided that we're not buying a cheaper, <laughs> we are going to burn all the branches that were cut down from uh, our olive trees. That's the job for today. I love a bonfire. <laughs> <laughs> How are we getting on with it? I'm just pausing the camera on you for as long as possible to make you feel awkward. <laughs> <laughs> so Christina's a secret pyromaniac. She does love a fire. <laughs> She'll be down here all day and all night just poking it. Isn't that right, Linda? <laughs> <laughs> I do like a fire. <laughs> down to check the olives or the trees that we had pruned and look there's loads of it I didn't think we we're gonna have any this year but first two trees look good this one went not have anything uh, this one ugly got any branches so oh wow that little one that's never had any olives look up on top it's yeah. great so this one has never had on it. No. Just here. Oh, there's Lincoln cranking oh. one out. <laughs> As you do. This well, one's... you might do. Huh? You might do in a field, but I don't. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, there's some. Not bad. Yeah. And imagine how easy it'll be to pick them. Absolutely. Okay, so um, we started burning all the rubbish, but we did find out the other day that you can borrow a chipper from the camera here. Well, it's not quite like that. Oh, right, it's not like that. Ignore what I said, that is a load of rubbish. Go on. <laughs> no, what it is, is they bring the chipper and they do the work. Right. So we don't go and borrow it. Oh, okay. And so they do it for free? They do it for free. Oh, well, there you go. Even better. I don't have to do anything. Another one that didn't have any olives, that was this one. Uh, uh, yeah. This one's not so. Uh, no. No. This one. Oh, look how full our well is. Wow. That is nearly to land level, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, last time I looked, last time I looked down there, it was about a metre from the from the um, ground level but um, I did mention before there's a black pipe you can probably just make it out there runs the cross there and that is an overflow which ordinarily would run to the stream but it's obviously blocked so it's not doing what it should be doing our well, brambles are doing well they're, they're yeah. taking off this year that comes dinking look the grass is too long for him yeah yeah um We've been fine-tuning the nurturing of our brambles and it seems to be going well. Yeah, there's another plum tree. Is this plums? Yeah. The figs. And the old figgy-diggy tree. Look at them bad boys. Ooh. So this, this plum tree, plum tree, this um, fig tree was buried in brambles uh, a few years ago and so we, we cut it all out. And it didn't have figs last year, no, did it? No. Didn't have figs, but this year it's producing. So, as is the one over there, that one that we uh, chopped right down, um, yeah, is now fully loaded with Thinking. figs. Full food. After remove water, yeah. oh. you see, maybe the sides maybe here. Maybe I remove more. After water, I don't know. I think like that. I think, not sure. Because it's the same way. I don't know. 
You see, it covers the whole for water and go inside. Yeah. Now, like that. Yeah. Oh, huh? Uh -huh. After see, because here more easy. Yeah. We don't need to go any deeper. Huh? I don't think we need to go any deeper. Mm -hmm. No. Now I make like that. You see? Yeah. Yeah, we, need, we need to get to here, but I don't know if we're going to yeah, yeah, yeah. go down yeah, there yeah. or... I don't know. Yeah. Why are we going to leave it? Yeah, just so that it's... Okay. So we've got a channel to go in. I might even go back this way and take everything in here. Mm -hmm. Ah, because I'm sorry. Know. You see, this pipe... I know that I can go. Because it's huge too. Inside, the camera's up. Boom! What happened here? I checked. Yeah, but it's. Let me just forget. No. I think this not, not like that. No, no. Uh, what is I think. Yeah. Forget this. Pipe, okay? no, this. This is going. Yeah. This is all going. Yeah. This is going. Right, it's time to close in this top section, uh, which is. Uh, not too difficult to do. Today I'm going to do what has become a routine every week now. I do um, ginger shots and for that I need pineapple, a lemon, one of our lemons that I've just washed, a lime and a green apple, also some ginger. So we have been taking these every day. I don't know if it helps or not because we're still not 100% over whatever bug we've had but when i got to the uk uh, my daughter always serves me with ginger shots and i actually like it okay if you want to see christina making these lemon shots the whole video of how she does it it'll be over on her channel christina makes i shall leave a link in the description so you can go over there and show your support and uh, watch how she did that we were given this some uh, maple syrup from canada which is very nice and these hats and this hat and Christine's got a hat and some other hats that we gave to uh, uh, the guys working for us and um, that was from Bill and Lorraine we really do appreciate that that's very kind of you and what else what else oh yes thank you uh, to Sarah and Pete Don and Alex for the coffees you bought us and also um, Alan for the super thanks that you gave us it's very very generous of you and we really do appreciate it thank you very very much right I think that's it oh one last thing Christina and I did an interview about our journey here to uh, Portugal the Algarve it was uh, just our experience of uh, how we dealt with it and what we did. Uh, if you want to take a look at that, that's over on YouTube, but the channel uh, Lemon Tree Homes, I'll leave a link in the description. So go over there and you can watch that. That's it. I've got nothing more to say. Testa. <coughs> Testa. Well. You've been testing it for two weeks. I know, look how healthy I am. Cheers. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you can say.
Yeah. You don't particularly, particularly like it, do you? I don't particularly like it, no. Mm. But Linda makes me drink it every... Every day. Every day. <clears throat> and I swear, since I've been drinking this, I've become unwell. I should go back to my chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> I was all right on chocolate. Since I've become healthy, I'm unhealthy. It's a beautiful morning. Dogs are going crazy. <clears throat> right, some time ago we took this down and we stopped because we wanted to get a man in with a digger to scoop out um, the concrete bit round here, which is a little bit of a problem for us. Not a problem, but um, what it is, is this, <clears throat> this is the original floor and then this was poured on top um, so when they had animals in here, they could wash the floor and it all ran down out there. And so this gradually gets thicker as it goes up. <clears throat> so I said we were going to get a digger in, but it's just, it's just uh, not possible at the moment because they're all so busy. So um, we need to go to plan B. So what we've decided to do is the guy who's helping us with the labouring up at the renovation is going to come here today and he's going to uh, start removing this. As I said, this is going round, or I've said in the previous videos, this rubble is going round there just to create a hardcore base for where we can park the truck. Um, <clears throat> see how it gets on. Um, it may come up easy. It may not. If it doesn't come up easy then we will uh, have to go to plan B. Uh, I think we do have a cunning plan B. Bravo. Bravo. <laughs> Crazy man. <laughs> yeah, fácil. Rather him. We'll learn that. Yeah, rather him than me. I don't think we're going to be mastering that little trick for a while. <laughs> we will give it a try. Yeah, we'll have a go. It's your trap. <laughs> but we shall see. Uh, anyway, that's the plan for in here today and then. We're going to be getting on with other things. Uh, I'll probably come and help him a bit later and uh, see how far he gets and, yeah, give him a helping hand. Anyway, I'm going to go and have a coffee. I do love the mornings. As you can see, everything is overgrown again. Right, just to give you a quick explanation. It was off. Uh, just give you a quick explanation of what's going on here. Um, originally, we thought that the the pipes to the uh, fossa, the, the waste tank, was along this line here. <clears throat> but we found out that that's not the case. We did discover earlier that in here, there was a mishmash and a mess of... Um, pipe system I've got no idea what this is uh, I don't even know how it works but there's the pipe there that goes that way diagonal out and then that runs round I'll show you around here I'm assuming that's the main waste out uh, and it runs deep down there about five foot down 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 and it runs all the way down <coughs> this side here oh, and to the fossa which is there uh, that means that we would need to dig out here um, get a digger in uh, which is I've said before is a little bit of a problem because everybody's busy with diggers so we're now going to continue this trench 
around through here. Down there. To there. Yeah, I hope that makes sense because I can't even make sense of it myself. Yesterday I cleaned the other side of the table and um, now I've started to put some polyurethane on it but forgot to press the button so I'm halfway there on this side and here we go. It's quite a nice colour wood which is lovely. So we're just going to uh, check on how the uh, floor is being taken up. Check on uh, our man Skinny. We call him Skinny because uh, I can't pronounce his name. So uh, yeah, he's doing a good job. Yeah, he's put all this out here now, ready for us to get it flattened, leveled down and compacted down. And I um, have to say, Skinny works like a, like a crazy man. And uh, he's a one man machine, so uh, it's quite fortunate to have him. So the table's all done and varnished. I also cleaned the hinges and the handles ready to assemble. And now, looking at this table, as you can see, I start standing here. It only had two coats of oil on it, and I think he needed some more. So, as I've got my sander out, I decided that. I'll uh, quick sand this and then put some lacquer on it, see if it lasts a bit longer. So the door is finished now, just need to let it dry and here the table, let's see if you can see that, um, has had two coats, I think I will put another coat on it so it's dry to touch now, it normally takes about half an hour or so but then before we start putting stuff on it we need to allow a few hours but it makes a huge difference to what it was so another job done right back in here <coughs> it's all rather embarrassing that we haven't finished this I'm just going to show you a clip of the first day we started building this and my optimism. Crack on with that and I want to get this done in a week hopefully so by the time this video ends it should be done. So I've uh, got a lot to do. Let's see how we get on. <laughs> right we're going to get on with the wiring now so while we're doing that the last bit of wiring around the back. Oh God. What do you want to say? What do you want to say? <laughs> Talking bloody rubbish. Okay, um, we're going to get on with the wiring, the final part of the wiring, which is just connecting a few last bits together before we close up the plasterboard on the other side. Um, so while we're doing that, we'll take you on a walk to the uh, barrage room to see how uh, what our water levels are like at the moment. Better day. 
days to come and carry us like wind in our sails. Hold on tight. I can smell the oh, So we come across this a big puddle. Yeah. Oh, look. Oh, wow. <laughs> There's a little one here. That's a big jump from here, is it not? I thought that's dry there, isn't it? Yeah. That's a... uh, no, but this is soaking in. Well, it's, it's, it's less of a jump there, isn't it? What about you just go... Ooh, Tarzan, jump. <laughs> Why don't you just go where I went? Well, what's the worst thing? I get wet, yeah? Yeah. The thing is, I can't take a run. No, but you just do, and you... Get I out of the way. What? This, this is a further leap than here, darling. Oh my days. I don't know whether to help you or just film you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to do because this is either going to go very well <laughs> or incredibly bad. <coughs> oh, dearie me. Now she thinks she's like a, an Olympic Hi. long jumper. Oh, <laughs> damn. There we go. Yeah, it didn't go well. No. <laughs> well done, you. Oh. Right, shall we go back now? <laughs> <laughs> the boys didn't exercise in the house. Uh, so, yeah, you might wonder where we're going. I haven't actually said yet. But we're going to the barrage to check our water levels. Um... The dam, and just the, the, the pond, the lake, whatever you want to call it. And just... remind ourselves how beautiful it is at this time of year. Yeah. Like my hat. Very nice. My daisy hat. She says life is good. Thank you, Bill and Lorraine, for my lovely hat. You sound out. Oh, wow. 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 Oh, my goodness. I don't think I've ever seen it this high. Huh? Wow. That's uh, definitely different. I wasn't expecting that. Huh? Oh. So... I'm going to put a little clip in on this. When we were last here, we were sitting all the way down there. Yeah, I know. So I'm not quite sure how far down, but it was a little way down. I would say that's come up uh, a lot. Quite a lot. Quite a lot. I've got no idea. Uh, yeah. Look at that. It's amazing. We're not going to run out of water this year. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we were way, down there. way down there. Wow. Good job. Pleasantly pleased. There we go. It's all done, it's all cleaned out. Uh, just got to sweep it up and then we can get on with building these walls. But before we build these walls, there's something else we're gonna tackle. Um, yeah, we need to get something else done just before we do that. Obviously, we've got to just do the last few bits in the uh, office, um, but we do have another job to do. And here we go, the rubble's there. Uh, we need to get that flattened and uh, compacted down so yep yeah, that's another job off the list
Right, that's all the insulation done. Now we can get on with plasterboarding. Action. Action. As you can see, we're nearly done. So just this little bit to do here and the other side. And that's perfect. All the wiring is done as well. So I just need to put the sockets and the switches, the fuse box. Uh, but oh, it's a bit dark here at the moment. But all is in place and now he's just finished the strip around the top. Yes. Yeah? Yes. It's good been job. a good two hour day. <laughs> hey? We worked, we done a good one. We worked plenty hard enough today. It's <laughs> not two hours, we've been at it all, all afternoon. <laughs> That's not two hours. All right, half day. You might have worked two hours. Yeah, no, no, I don't I give me that. Longer. Yeah. So we come to this uh, shop to buy an RSJ and so we're just going to load it up in the truck and uh, it means we can move forward with the kitchen area. Here we go, an RSJ. Oh, excuse the wind. Deck lift's happy. It's Can... easy to lift. Yeah, yeah. Just got to get it off the other end. Right, this RSJ is for the kitchen at the renovation project. Um, just to clarify that, uh, where we took the wall down to open up the kitchen area. Uh, this is to take the load of the, the uh, ceiling above. So once we get this up, which is going to be a challenge in itself, um, we can then get on with the subfloor and the underfloor heating. So that's good that we got it. All these things take time. Um, so there's a lot of preparation going on. And that brings me to my next uh, point. Uh, we were asked why we don't do any work up at the renovation. We just turn up and film things. The reason is that we're not doing the preparation work. We're not doing the, like the groundwork as such and digging holes. We're, we don't we don't need to dig holes. Um, we just uh, will go in once everything's prepped for us to carry on. Um, and all I'm doing is going up there and making sure that things are going on and what we need doing is being done. So, yeah, uh, very shortly uh, we will be going up there quite regularly to do work and um, yeah, we're gonna get very busy, but while we're waiting, that's why we're doing work down here, uh, doing the office and things, and bits and pieces here that we need doing before we get on up there. Um, that is the reason, that's the reason why we uh, are not digging holes. I'm getting too old to dig holes, to be fair. And I don't think Christina wants to dig holes either. Hope that clears that up.
So we had trouble getting the man with the digger, so we became the men with the digger. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the men in black, men in deep. <laughs>